Hello, so do you know how to solve such an amazing maths problem? So worry not, I will take you step by step on how to solve it. So let's now start with the solution. So on our solution, this one is what we have. So we have 3 to the power of a plus 3 to the power of a is equals to 36. So the first thing that we need to do, we need to factorize 3 to the power of a plus 3 to the power of a. So now this one can also be written as 3 to the power of a into bracket 1 plus 1 is equals to 36. So the next step that you are going to do, you are going to work out the number that is inside the bracket. So that is now we shall now have 3 to the power of a into bracket 1 plus 1 is 2 is equals to 36. So from here now we shall divide both sides by 2, then also this side by 2. So now 2 by 2 now we shall cancel this 2 by 2 out so that now we shall remain with 3 to the power of a is equals to, so 2 here once, 2 into 36, we shall have 18. So now we shall have 3 to the power of a is equals to 18. So now how do we move on from here? So it is the best thing. So what we are going to do, we shall introduce the log from both sides. So here now we shall have the log of 3 to the power of a is equals to the log of 18. So remember that when you have something like the log of p, to the power of m can also be written as m the log of p so in this case now we shall now have three the log of three to the power of a can also be written as a the log of three is equals to the log of 18 so from here now we shall divide both sides by the log of three so that now we shall remain with a so here now we shall divide all over the log of three then this one all over the log of three so the log of 3 and the log of 3 shall cancel each other so that our value for a in this case now shall be equals to a is equals to the log of 18 all over. So there now shall have the log of the log of 3. So our next step now shall say that. So here now we shall say that our value for a is equals to. So the log of 18 can also be written as the log of 3 multiplied by 6 then all over the log of the log of 3. So remember that, assume that you have the log of a, a, b. So this one can also be written as the log of a plus the log of, of b. So here now we shall say that our value for a, so our a is equals to, so this one now shall have the log of 3 plus the log of 6, then all over, so all over the log of 3. So now we shall have the log of 3 here. So now our value for a shall be equals to. So we shall now have to divide both sides by the log of 3. So here now we shall have the log 3. Then all over the log of 3. Then also plus the log 6. All over the log of the log of 3. So from there now we shall say that our value for a, so our a is equals to, so log 3 and log 3 shall cancel, so now we shall now have 1 plus, so this one now shall have the log of 6 all over the log of 3. So the log of 6 all over the log of 3. So from there now we shall say that, assume that we have the log a all over the log of b, like the log of a all over the log of of b so this one can also be written as the log of a to the base of to the base of b so then now we shall now say that so that is to mean that our a which is equals to 1 plus the log of 6 to the log of 3 shall be written as a is equals to 1 then plus so we have the log of 6 to the base of 3 so now this one now shall qualify to be our final answer so if you loved how we worked out this maths problem, please don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.